All right, so it looks like Sam Altman, the CEO of OpenAI, is spearheading a huge project marked by an investment goal that's nothing short of staggering, up to $7 trillion. This amount surpasses the GDP of the UK and France combined. In the next few minutes, I'll talk about the details of this ambitious project, exploring its significance and the potential impact it could have on the future of AI. This project, initiated by Sam Altman of OpenAI, targets a critical issue in the AI industry, the shortage of AI chips. OpenAI recognizes that the current global supply of AI chips is insufficient to meet the rapidly growing demand. This shortage is a bottleneck for AI progress, affecting not just OpenAI, but also major tech companies worldwide. Altman's bold strategy is to transform the global semiconductor industry, aiming to dramatically ramp up AI chip production. He envisions a collaborative effort involving chip manufacturers, suppliers, and consumers to support the swift expansion of AI. This massive undertaking calls for a colossal investment of up to $7 trillion. Altman is looking for potential investors, including entities like the UAE, and leveraging social media to build momentum for creating a durable AI infrastructure. This infrastructure is envisioned to sustain the increasing demands for data processing and power required by advanced AI systems. Sam Altman's vision for the global semiconductor industry is a response to the current challenges in the AI chip market. Presently, the market is grappling with several issues. It's dominated by a few key players like NVIDIA, Intel, AMD, and Qualcomm, who, despite their expertise, are struggling to meet the soaring demand for AI chips. This demand is growing at a pace that outstrips their production capabilities. Moreover, these companies are hitting the physical and technical limits of current chip technology hindering their ability to innovate and improve AI chips at the necessary rate. And since there's pressure from other chip-dependent industries like automotive and smartphones, this means AI chips are not being offered at affordable prices. This situation poses significant problems for organizations like OpenAI, which rely heavily on these chips for powering AI projects. Their growth and innovation are being stymied by the lack of access to the necessary chips. Sam Altman aims to transform it by creating a new ecosystem for chip production that aligns manufacturers, suppliers, and users to address the global needs of AI. His strategy involves investing in chip companies, establishing factories for efficient chip production, and exploring innovative chip technologies such as neuromorphic and quantum chips. Altman's plan also includes collaborating with other AI organizations, governments, and stakeholders who share his vision. Sam Altman's plan has serious potential to revolutionize the AI industry, allowing it to flourish unimpeded, leading to significant advancement. The push for a new semiconductor strategy is driven by a simple yet profound realization. The current system is inadequate for meeting the fast-growing demands of AI. This inadequacy is not just about technology or tools, it's about keeping pace with a force that is rapidly reshaping every aspect of our existence. AI is bringing forth opportunities, challenges, and even problems. It's altering our ways of thinking, communicating, learning, working, playing, and living at a pace and scale that's difficult to comprehend. The AI market is projected to soar to over $250 billion by 2027, growing at an annual rate of 33.2%. The computing power required for AI is expected to double every 3.4 months, potentially increasing by 300,000 times within a decade. By 2030, AI could contribute a massive $15 trillion to the global economy, boosting it by 14%. The existing infrastructure is struggling to manage the enormous data volumes AI generates and utilizes, meet the extensive energy requirements of AI systems, provide the intensive computing power essential for AI operations, accommodate the diverse range of AI models, and support the vast array of AI applications. To address these shortcomings and ensure that AI can continue its trajectory of rapid development, a comprehensive overhaul of the semiconductor industry is crucial for the future of AI and its continued contribution to global progress. Now the key question is, how will Sam Altman secure the vast sum of money required for this ambitious project? $7 trillion is a huge amount of money, 
This is more than the top 10 richest people's net worths combined and multiplied by four. The primary source of such a massive investment could be sovereign wealth funds. These funds are enormous investment reserves managed by nations holding significant financial resources and typically investing in large-scale, long-term projects that promise economic and societal benefits. A prime example is the United Arab Emirates Abu Dhabi Investment Authority, a fund with over a trillion dollars at its disposal. Such funds could be key players in backing this groundbreaking initiative, drawn by the potential of AI to revolutionize industries and spearhead economic growth. Their involvement would not only provide the necessary financial backing, but also signify a global recognition of the project's significance and potential impact. Sovereign wealth funds, such as those managed by the UAE, represent a significant potential source of investment for Sam Altman's project. They are known for their global investments in various sectors, including technology, infrastructure, and energy. The UAE, in particular, could be instrumental in funding Altman's vision, providing substantial financial support and access to the Middle East's growing AI market. However, relying on sovereign wealth funds comes with certain challenges. These funds often operate with a degree of secrecy and may have their own undisclosed agendas, potentially seeking influence over the project's direction. Additionally, their involvement could introduce political complexities, especially if other nations perceive the project as a strategic threat. Private equity firms are another viable funding source. They are typically drawn to ambitious projects with the promise of high returns. A notable player in this domain is SoftBank's Vision Fund, which has a substantial $100 billion earmarked for technology investments. This fund could offer valuable support to Altman, along with access to Asia's expansive AI market. However, private equity firms usually seek swift financial returns and might steer the project in less favorable directions. Moreover, they could conflict with other investors who have different visions for the project's future. Tech giants such as Google, Microsoft, and Meta also emerge as potential investors. These companies have significant financial resources and a vested interest in groundbreaking technologies. Microsoft, already collaborating with OpenAI, could be a partner providing financial support an entry point into the North American AI market. However, partnerships with such tech giants carry their own set of complications. These companies may seek to overly integrate the project with their existing products and strategies, limiting its autonomy. Furthermore, they could face opposition from competitors and regulatory bodies concerned about their growing influence. From an economic standpoint, AI is a powerhouse. It's expected to greatly boost the global economy by adding trillions of dollars and creating millions of jobs. This shows just how important AI infrastructure is in supporting this significant growth. Socially, the influence of AI is extensive and deeply felt, touching every part of our lives and set to grow even more. Its remarkable ability to change things calls for easy to use and reliable AI systems. These systems are essential to make the most out of AI's benefits, address new challenges, and make sure everyone can be a part of the future shaped by AI. Sam Altman's vision goes beyond just technological innovation. He's focused on creating a future where we can fully harness AI's capabilities on a worldwide scale. This underscores the broader significance of his project, extending past the realm of just tech developments. OpenAI's aim has always been to drive AI forward in a way that benefits all of humanity, ultimately striving to reach a level of AI that's as smart and capable as humans. Since starting out, OpenAI has grown and changed a lot. It has widened its research areas, brought out influential new tools, and continually adapted to the shifting tech landscape with significant changes and updates in leadership. Important shifts in leadership, such as Sam Altman becoming chairman and the creation of new executive roles, shows AI's ongoing growth and commitment to its ambitious goals. Recent updates in leadership and the makeup of the board are about aligning OpenAI's strategy for the upcoming challenges and opportunities in AI. These changes mark OpenAI's transition from a nonprofit to a more diverse business model, focusing on leveraging the power of AI while skillfully navigating the competitive and cooperative aspects of the AI world.